What is up, Smack Empire? Smack Empire here. Welcome back to another Dark Decision video. Your favorite audio is back, ladies and gentlemen. And today we are going to take a look at my favorite or five best Dark Deception fan games. Quick disclaimer, these are the games that I've played personally on the channel and these are the ones that are actually out that you can play right now as we speak, except for one. <laughs> We're just gonna talk about it. So you know what, without wasting any more time, let's freaking go. All right, at number five, we have, ladies and gentlemen, Fazbear Deception. Now this one obviously has been one of my favorite, not only FNAF fan games, but also Dark Deception fan game. This game had so many experiences expansions from the abnormalities of the Agni, new animatronics were added in here, and if you compare the first bill to now, it is a completely changed and a different game. I loved it. The gameplay is clean, the scares are there, they are a bit loud, so sometimes they do become a bit annoying, but apart from that, uh, give me the good stuff. And at number four, ladies and gentlemen, we have Demon's Deception. Now this is kind of unfair because this is just a demo of Demon's Deception. I thought I played this game a long time ago, which I haven't, so we'll get to that game which I played that I was comparing this game with in a bit, but Demon's Deception is a fan game of Dark Deception X Bendy and the Ink Machine franchise. Now one might say, okay Smack, these are not purely Dark Deception fan games, you have crossover fan games. That is correct, but we don't have fully fleshed fan games that are specifically focused in Dark Deception universe that are good as well, that are enjoyable, that are fun, so you know what, we'd have to go with the ones that we already have. These are actually smart games as well. Demon's Deception demo came out a few months ago, I believe. I played it on the channel, I got the demo, obviously. It was so much fun. The voice actor for the demon is clean, it does get a bit dark, it does have some optimizations issues, but you know what, overall, it is a fun experience. I would highly recommend you to check it out, especially if you're a Bendy fan, you're not gonna have a lot of Bendy fan games so come here to dark deception you're gonna get some of that good stuff then at number three one of my personal favorite games from dark deception fan game universe admins hell if it wasn't for the top two this would have been my number one pick admins hell was the first game that i truly enjoyed that i truly said yes this is what i am looking for in dark deception fan games custom shards difficulty was bumped all the way up it was really enjoyable especially the second zone hold up admins hell i need full game all five chapters i don't care give me that it is a bit difficult it is team fortress to cross over with dark deception fan game so it's not completely original but the concept is there the gameplay is there most importantly which is the essence of dark deception the most important factor of why we love and enjoy dark deception story comes afterwards for me it might be number one but gameplay is the real deal out here and admins hell captures just that it may be on mistake it might be unintentional but the fact that it does capture the essence is what i like to hear and see and play Ugh. then before we get to the top two ladies and gentlemen we have some honorable mentions these are two honorable mentions that i want to see more of before i put them in any top list number one is bendy and lost in darkness this i believe is a russian game it does have english translation which you can play i played i believe two chapters i'm not quite sure it is actually clean but it's not on the level as demons of deception but it is still worth mentioning and the final one in the honorable mentions we have devil's deception this was the game that I accidentally compared with the demon's deception i mean look at the titles devil's deceptions demon's deception come on devil's deception was really one of the first bendy dd fan games that i played at number two this is unfair to y'all but i'm just gonna put it out there it is mascot mayhem fan made level by fans reaper now fans reaper they are working on a public build hopefully for mascot mayhem with the daytime completely remanned completely made from the ground up but i did play the mascot mayhem that they released privately for a few peeps i was one of them i was lucky enough to be one of them you saw me playing with that freaking pig as the only character in there it was a daytime level i managed to beat his butt not once not twice three times but the next one hopefully will have all three characters and the number one no surprises there ladies and gentlemen prepare your butts for this one actually it is torment therapy by frebby every single update for this game just elevated the level and experience from the first one and the first one was when i played it i was like yeah the best fan game i've played it literally captures star deception feeling in it the gameplay the story you can feel it it is there but most 
most importantly one thing it does get wrong in my opinion is the unnecessary traps there are far too many even though the update did nerf some traps but they're still there in so many places that they get unnecessary like okay come on dev you're, you're overdoing it but all these games awesome good job and i'm sure by 2021 we'll have some of the best fan games out there i can't wait to get my hands on them like i said before fans contribution are the most important thing in any community especially for indie community fan games are more important than anything else i'll leave you with that one ladies and gentlemen make sure to let me know your five picks for the best fan games the only way i will count them as top five or even in the list if they are out for public to play you can't hold me accountable like hey smack we can't play man's got Mayhem by fans reaper so just take this as top four best fan games i don't care but with that being said subscribe to now 45k i'm gonna get to 50k before chapter 4 follow me on twitter and insta at the rate smack and pie and i'll see you boys on the flip flop inside <laughs>